going on YouTube this is good call six here uh, just bringing you some uh, recent pickups uh, I got a bunch of eBay stuff three redemptions um, from panini yeah two for yeah they're all from panini so um, quite a few pickups six or so and then those redemptions so um, go ahead and bring you those here for you uh, really tired lately got a whole bunch of stuff going on baseball I was in a softball tournament this weekend took second place so that was real fun got rained out though so that kind of sucked um, but heading out for tournaments this weekend then next weekend got tournaments and then got our city tournament going on for baseball so I've been real busy lately um, it's getting kind of exhausted so we'll get right into these pickups here um, I already have this card, but I picked this one up for three bucks, so I couldn't pass that up. It's a Josh Freeman limited monikers auto, the silver version, number to fifty. So I was happy to pick that one up. And these cards used to be used to go for quite a bit, like fifteen bucks more than what I wanted to spend on them. Um, but this one I got for pretty cheap also. Uh, it's a Daquan Bowers contenders auto. I didn't have that, so I was happy to pick that up for like five bucks. So that was pretty cool. Um, let's see what else. I'll show these ones last. Um, then I got this card in. I actually got that Josh Freeman and this card in the same lot, and the seller shipped that in. A, shipped this in a magnetic, so I was pretty happy with that. I don't even. This is play out of playoff. Ninety nine playoff. Uh, it's Boss Hogs. Mike Allstott that silver ink auto on like I don't know if that's actual ball or that's just a leather panel uh, I don't know it doesn't say so uh, it's a really cool looking card not in the greatest shape but it is almost 15 years old so can't go can't expect too much out of it I guess but it's just a really awesome card with that that silver ink on it so um, and then this, I was really, really happy to get with this. I got this for a pretty decent price, too. And the seller also shipped in a magnetic, so um, can't go wrong with that. It's uh, Bowman Signatures, Doug Martin. It's those refractor helmet things. Really cool card. Second Doug Martin autograph. I would never buy a box of this stuff for 200 bucks. The hobby stuff, anyways. Just way too much for what these cards look like. I'm not a fan of them. But these cards are pretty cool, so... Um, and then I got w actually two more, but this, two were redemptions, and this one was a pickup off eBay. This is a really awesome card. I, this guy had a buy now on it for thirty nine ninety nine um, a while back. I sent him an offer. He didn't accept it. He rejected it. And then he put it in standard auction, and it ended up going for the amount that I offered him. Um, so I was happy with that. It's an awesome patch on it. Uh, Randall Cobb, Crown Royal. Silhouette, three color, got the white, green, yellow. It's like paint looking. It's not like the other ones that I've seen. Um, so I was really, really happy to pick that up. Really nice card. Uh, number 22 and 299. I was happy to pick that up. Awesome card. And then these two, I had a redemption. I bought a redemption off eBay for this card. And then my brother actually pulled one like two days after I bought the redemption. Um... But we find we got these both in. Um, this one is mine. It's Jonathan Baldwin, Crown Royal, two color patch auto, number to two ninety nine. And then this one's his. This one's actually the three color on it. A bunch of white on it, which I don't know. At least it's a three color. So he said I could put that towards my set. So that was really awesome of him to let me do that. Um, and this one's numbered to seven of two ninety nine. I actually only need 17 more of these, I think. But they're all the really expensive ones. The Dalton, Locker, Mallet, Cam Newton, AJ Green, DeMarco Murray. Marshall Darius is even go for 40, 50 bucks just for the redemptions. Um, so, I don't, I don't know. I'm going to have to try to win the lotto, win me some money, or pick up some trade bait cards. But this one actually is kind of a trade bait card. Um... I pulled this out of a box of contenders three or four months ago. Um, I got the Jake Locker out of it, and then this one was Redemption. And I got this was this one in on Friday or Saturday. Um, it's a really nice card. Demarco Murray 
on card contenders. It's not the SP version, I don't think, because I think the SP version doesn't have that Riddell logo on his helmet. Let's see if I can get it in there. But um, nonetheless, it's a really nice card. Looks to be in pretty good, really good shape, actually. A little bit of white showing on the back corner, but uh, otherwise, it's a great looking card. Um, this card will be for sale for trade if I can get something. Um, my Crown Royal set or something like that. Otherwise, I'll probably just give it to my brother if I can't get anything out of it. So if you're interested in that, go ahead and hit me up and let me know about that. Um, so, and then this, my brother got this in for his uh, playbook set. Uh, another one of these. This one's a sweet card. Um, Vincent Brown, number to 399. Shwam. Whole bunch of breaks. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. 12 breaks. Four color. Awesome card on, on card auto. He's probably got 15, 16 of these left. He's got a couple of the bigger ones knocked out with the locker because he got lucky and pulled that one himself. So, um, so yeah, that's an awesome card. I really hope he gets this set completed. That That's going to be a badass set to have. Um, with all those books. I think there's 36 of them. That would be a pretty sweet set to complete. So, yeah, guys, that's all I got for this week. I don't have anything coming in this week that I know of, I don't, that I've bought yet. Um, unless Panini gets all crazy and starts sending out some Stephen Ridley redemptions. Um, might not have some stuff for a while. So it might be a while in between my next videos. So, um, other than that, I guess I hope everyone had a good Father's Day. Um, happy Father's Day, late Father's Day to all you fathers out there and also my dad. So, uh, yeah, guys, thanks for watching. Peace.